All right, so here's the SciTac mid-drop duty holster. It's supposed to fit universally to many weapons. They do have a list of those weapons on their website and on Amazon if you're looking to buy this. Here we've got ourselves the Glock 42 380 Smith & Wesson EZ Shield 380 Smith & Wesson 40 and a Glock 19X with the light, but we'll be disengaging the light with this holster. Let's see if they fit. All right, let's not waste any more time. So, Cytac says this fits multiple weapons. All you got to do is have the right Allen key. You go ahead and adjust all the way around. And essentially, you're opening and closing in certain spots. You can see inside the camera here, the index finger falls here locking mechanisms all the way to the right so that's going to be locking on to the trigger guard portion of the firearms so right now i did adjust it to fit my mp40 here it is i'm going to pull so you can see the play so maybe an eighth of an inch tops and again, I can tighten this if I feel like I need to. So Smith & Wesson 40 works. Now, at the same tension, the EZ clicks in there, but here's the play. So we're going to go ahead and adjust that and see how this feels. Still got a little play here, I'm not liking it. It's not something that uh, I'd be proud to shoot right now. So let's keep on going. Okay, so I'm feeling pretty maxed out. On this holster we've got a little back and forth play here let's see if we can disengage we can't let's do some more adjusting so again we got a little bit of play here this is the easy shield this is the 380 model which the nine millimeter is similar so um, is it locked in there? Yes. I'm not a fan of what's going on here with the play. Um, it is working. Maybe someone's looking to use this at the range or something. But, uh, you know, I would not be taking this into the real world at all with an easy shield. So let's see where we stand with the Glock 42. Okay, we clicked on in. Again, there's just a little bit of play there. I got the clip here for inside the waistband, but it's not really affecting it. This, this is not fitting these smaller size 380s here at all. So we're gonna go ahead and disengage the Glock and see what happens with the Glock here. Okay, so I've made some adjustments with the Allen key and um, we just went from the smaller self-defense type weapons, we're moving back to a Glock 19X 9mm. Um, before the Smith & Wesson 40, you could see fit just fine in here with some adjustment. So we've gone smaller, now we've gone bigger again. And I do get a good solid fit. Okay, index finger naturally falls right where it's supposed to. Hands end up high on the tang here on the pistol. The draw is good. All this with an Allen key, just simply adjust all the way around. Now. Again, that's two different companies that do fit into one holster. If that's what you're looking for, this is gonna get it done. There are some teeth that you can go ahead and adjust in between the holster here. And you can get the correct cant that is preferred to you and tighten that up simply with an Allen key as well. Here's the backside. This is to wrap around your thigh. And again, this is a mid-drop, not a fully tactical thigh-dropped holster, but mid-drop. Uh, duty holster according to SciTac. However, uh, you know, we just 
you know, this is the mid drop holster. So um, can go up and down, you can adjust that. And here's the belt adjustments. We got some teeth here to uh, grip on the belt, keep it from going left to right. Uh, if you ever had to uh, get a little active with this thing on. So um, I think it's great for the airsoft player. I think it's great for the range. I think it's great for the person who has multiple full-size pistols, who wants to switch over company to company. And you can simply adjust with an Allen key. Does it work? It feels solid, yes. Um, it is not light bearing. We did have to take off the Streamlight TLR7 off of the Glock 19X. Uh, it is not a light bearing holster, but it is universal to the other holsters that SciTac makes. So for instance, if we wanted to take this paddle holster off of this, they do hop onto each other. Um, so I could essentially take this Glock 19X uh, light bearing holster that I just did in another video, drop it on this mid-length and go ahead and carry that. Um, could be good for maybe uh, some detectives out there if your department lets you pick your own holster. Um, I think that would be okay. I think it's great for the range. Again, maybe those active airsoft players that are looking to get a little on the quote unquote high speed side of things, but SciTac is the company. It does work more or less with the full size, different companies, the slimmer personal defense stuff. You probably want to keep inside the waistband anyhow, other than the range. Um, it is not working with that. All with an Allen key. Easy stuff, no fluff. Roger that USA. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hope that helps you.